I'm at Hollywood Studios and it's a little bit hotter than I thought it was but I see someone over here that I'm gonna go say hello to Aladdin I like your fence. It's pretty cool right yeah you I like my hat too. Feather too oh Maybe you can ask the genie you some of those special genie wishes right yeah a genie of your own. Uh, nope. No do you genies. have one to spare? Now, our genie's actually free and he travels the world. Oh. And actually give out freebie genie wishes, which are the best kind, right? Because they're free. I'll take a free but wish. if you find a lamp, you can always rub it and say, Genie, are you in there? And if he is, he might grant you some wishes. I'm going to remember that. Pretty cool, right? Now, do you want to come on over here and take a portrait together? Yes, let's do that. How nifty and cool was that? Aladdin just hanging out waiting for photos up front. That's as soon as you walk in the park there. There's always a hidden character over there. Well, not always, but always look to your right. You'll never know who will be there. But anyway, I'm at Hollywood Studios and uh, not sure what I'm doing here. But I am gonna do something. So uh, let's go do this. I was checking out all of the different uh, signatures and handprints of all the different celebrities like Donald Duck, the one and only. And I started realizing that some of them are just disappearing. Like I was looking at Ernie Hudson over here <laughs> and it looks just so planned and it's just his name and his handprints but you can barely see it look at that just hanging out Ooh. Woo. oh boy watch out oh look how nifty if that's gonna land right there that's pretty cool wow I didn't even plan for that to happen but man I missed a great movie ride I don't know what it was about. It was like the perfect chill out ride. In a hot day at Hollywood Studios, there was nothing like boarding and just riding through the air conditioning. Uh-oh, Star Wars is happening. That means basically anything I say is gonna get interrupted by loud bangs and lightsaber noises. While that's going on, I'm gonna head on down to Grand Avenue. That is a tragedy right there. Someone dropped their cotton candy. Can you believe that? I'm gonna pick it up. <clears throat> Nobody wants to step in that. And it'll probably cause a big mess eventually, so we're gonna do a favor there. You missing some cotton candy? No? I didn't think so. <laughs> yes, I am gonna find a place to wash my hands. I know you were thinking that. Wow, Baseline is super popular today. Ooh, got a full house. It must be Bureau Clock. That's the only thing. So this is Grand Avenue, but this is Grand Park. Home of the Muppets. Because the Muppets are in the Grand Theater. Or shall I say the Grand Arts Theater. Sorry about that. They're slowly starting to get rid of all the cool Muppet art. Like you see this building right here. Uh, they used to have, I don't know what you call these, rain gutters? See how the rain gutters are painted like little men? See that purple face up there? And all of a sudden they repainted that one and took it away. I wonder why. I also wonder how much those apartments for rent are up there. Can you imagine living there? Wow. Kind of looks like a dump, but it's really not. It's just the outside. On the inside, it's got to be glamorous. While I'm down in the Grand Park area, I do want to stop into Mama Melrose Ristorante Italiano because I'm not hungry, but I do like how it's decorated on the inside, and I figured I'd show you a little bit. And uh, I ate here before, but I wasn't that much of a fan, only because I'm very plain picky eater, so it wouldn't really appeal to me. But I do love the inside, so let's take a look in there, eh? Look at the pretty lights hanging from the ceiling. 
<laughs> That's what I like about it, is the lights. <laughs> That's probably the biggest thing. They also have an open kitchen, so you can actually see your food getting prepped. I think that's really awesome. Or you can sit at the bar area. Wow. Sorry about the quality of picture uh, inside Mama Melrose. Uh, I'm using the original camera that I actually started with. Well, I didn't start with it because I had a cell phone, but this is the first camera that uh, I bought to start vlogging. I don't uh, have the G7X with me anymore. So for right now, I'm just gonna work with what I got. And this is a great camera. Nothing wrong with it, just very not good with low light and uh, stabilization, picture clarity, stuff like that. I am going to invest probably into a new camera in the future. So hang tight with me. And if you also do want to help support the channel in getting a new camera, I'm going to put my PayPal uh, in the uh, description below. So, uh, I mean, anything helps. I'm not really uh, throwing it out there or anything like that, but why not, right? So, uh, let's head back over to the center part by the Grand. I lost what I was saying. One of these days, I'm going to walk around this corner and finally see somebody else in the celebrity spotlight. I feel like Olaf has been in the spotlight for way too long. This needs to be for anything new up and coming movies. Like this is where Aladdin should have been in the celebrity spotlight because right now they just released a trailer for Aladdin and that makes sense. Olaf has been in here for a very, very long time. Ooh, the Xbox game port is open. I very rarely get to go in here. They used to have something like this at Epcot, uh, where the uh, Chase character meet and greet was. But it's a really cool place to relax. Play some video games. And uh, I think charge your phones. Yeah, because there should be some chargers in here. I like how they now label the <laughs> dust pans. This is for theater use only. I love these things. You call them silent butlers. Does anybody else call them silent butlers? Oh. Hello, brave little toaster. Look at the kids helping tape up for the firework viewing. How cool is that? Walk the line. Yep, yep. You thought about it, do it. Yeah, get on it. There we go, walk the line. <laughs> One thing I did notice is that they have a special sneak peek at Dumbo down at Walt Disney Presents. I'm excited for that movie. I really am. And look how cool this Dumbo statue is. Wow. I could put this in my living room. Of course, I'd rather have that Dumbo in my living room though. The original Dumbo was way cooler looking. I just got done checking out the sneak peek for Dumbo and I am very excited for that movie. Uh, I always liked Dumbo. Uh, I didn't watch it until I was older actually. Uh, I didn't watch it as a kid. So I really liked it when I did get older. But I'm gonna let you guys in on a big secret. If you were at Hollywood Studios and you come and watch the sneak peek for Dumbo at Walt Disney Presents, if you ask the attendant when you leave, they will give you a Dumbo poster for free that is really cool isn't it a free Dumbo picture well poster I'm gonna hang this on a wall somewhere I think this is a good spot I need tape I'm gonna stay have tape well they wouldn't give me tape so I went over to the DVC stand and they gave me a bunch of stickers so I'm gonna sticker it up on a wall somewhere <laughs> Well, it's not a wall, but I think this is kind of cool. So I'm gonna hang it right there. Look at that, it looks so good. And it's themed in the right theming area because you know, I didn't want to put it somewhere else that you know was out of theming, but since they have the Dumbo flyers hanging up over here, it kind of looks like it belongs there. I changed my mind. I want my Dumbo picture back. There it is. Now everyone's gonna think I'm stealing it. <gasps> oh, look at what I just did. Now they're gonna think I'm destroying Walt Disney World property. Oh boy. I can fix this, I can fix this. 
here we go. Here we go. I'm gonna just get the sticker off. I never wanted this sticker here. <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm just gonna stick that there. And I'm gonna flip it over. Perfect. You couldn't even tell. <laughs> it definitely looks like it's gonna start raining soon and these trees might start throwing apples at me they're just angry so I think I'm gonna leave before I, the rain comes oh but they're doing a family picture you know those things where the guy starts yelling family picture and everybody runs over oh I'm gonna miss it I'm gonna miss it wait for me wait for me wait for me yep family picture right here okay I'm gonna get right here oh I got an idea If the picture was a little crooked, I didn't have time to set up the tripod very neatly. You know, I had to get in there, so I'm sure it was great though. And I did get a picture. I got a copy of it, so I can't wait to see how it turns out. Like I said, that's it. Done for today. So, uh, love the life you live, and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye! Can I show you guys the most beautiful thing I've ever recorded? Beautiful. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> sorry. And I think I'll put it on my fridge. That didn't work. Beautiful, huh?